what the majority of people are suffering with now are symptoms or signs of metabolic syndrome. Its root is insulin resistance. So we are over nutrition, often under mustard. And so what happens, the body starts to resist because it, it's never lived in an environment where it's had over nutrition, it's had the complete opposite. Does that overnourish mean that you're yeah. eating? We're, we're eating too much of the wrong food and we're not moving enough. You would think that longevity sounds like a fancy term with lots of drugs and stuff that you get from the clinic. But actually, when you understand it, it's not. Are you sleeping enough? Are you eating healthily? Are you overnourished? And our expert on the show today is going to show us the steps we need to follow so that we can live a healthier life. So welcome to the show, the incredibly smart and talented Dr. Nass. I think the traditional belief amongst most people, including doctors, is that Alzheimer's is inevitable. Well, it doesn't have to be. There are definitely people who are genetically predisposed, but I mean, there's a reason why there's been a huge boom in Alzheimer's, even if you correct for an aging population. The thing with longevity and medicine in general is it's evolving all the time. You can't have firmly held views. You have to adapt with the science and the evidence. Was COVID a scam? <laughs> Well, how deep do you want to go into the conspiracies? <laughs> I'm sure you're a theorist.